From Creamer Media in Johannesburg, this is The Real Economy Report. As part of its pipeline of 175,000 square meter of retail space, earmarked for township and peri-urban areas across South Africa, property developer Ali Rhodes has unveiled its first retail development, Riverstone Mall in Mayerton. Sabrina Jardim tells us more. The development of the 370 million Rand Mall currently under construction is financed by Rand Merchant Bank, a division of First Rand Bank, and is scheduled to open in early 2025. On completion, the convenience mall with a gross lettable area of 18,000 square meters is expected to have 53 retail tenants and will be anchored by Checkers Fresh X, Woolworths Food and Dischem. Other retailers include Clicks, Trueworths, Mr. Price and the Pepco Group. It will also offer a thousand parking bays, a food court and two fast food drive through outlets. Our expectation ultimately is that this thing is going to trade exceptionally well. Added to that obviously is the fact that We've got the residential next door here, which will also create further demand for, for, for the retail. It's part of our strategic objective of creating, uh, you know, precincts where we've got both residential and retail because there, there is a, a symbiotic relationship between the two. Integration between residential development and retail is is key for us because it's it's the cost of the cost of transportation nowadays has become so high that you want to have your schools your hospitals your retail centers close to your place where you live at the moment and as time goes by we will be doing integrated developments where we have the full social sector that goes with our residential developments speaking at the pre-launch event on may 16th Mudval mayor peter teixeira described the development as a first of its kind within the jurisdiction We've never had a shopping complex or a mall of this nature in, in Mayerton or Midvale. And, um, you know, for me it's quite important uh, because we want to grow the local economy and currently people have to go outside of our jurisdiction to actually access the type of uh, businesses or retail stores that would be made available here. So we are quite excited with the development. A 1,908 kilovolt amp solar plant will be installed on the roof with a battery backup of 4,800 kilowatt hours, equivalent to four hours of 1,200 kilovolt amps, ensuring the mall remains operational during load shedding periods. Moreover, Ali Road CEO Barry Chapman explained during the pre-launch that the development is expected to create about 1,200 jobs during the construction phase with an estimated 250 permanent jobs to be created once open. We see it as a catalyst for, um, for further development in the area, which obviously will create further jobs. Um, so the spin-offs in terms of job creation are really amazing in terms of the site. Look, it will benefit the municipality um, in terms of growing the economy, the local, it will boost the local economy. It will bring more feet into our area. I believe that even out, people outside of our jurisdiction will want to come and visit this beautiful facility here because I think it is quite unique. As you can see, the Clip River runs through here and uh, I can already picture myself sitting somewhere there uh, having coffee um, while I have a view of the beautiful Clip River there. So it will definitely boost the local economy. Um, I'm excited especially for the jobs, the amount of jobs that it will create for our local people. And, um, you know, it's, it's, it's something that we, the community is very excited about, you know. Um, we can't wait until it opens its doors. Um, and I believe that, we, um, you know, a business of this nature will definitely thrive and will do very well within our area. The group will roll out its 175,000 square meter retail development pipeline over the next seven years, mainly in Gauteng, but also potentially in the Northwest, Free State and the Western Cape. Alley Roads intends to develop rural convenience retail centers, measuring between 6,000 square meters to 12,000 square meters. In Mayerton, Alley Roads is soon launching a residential development comprising 337 units as part of its strategy to leverage the symbiotic relationship between housing and retail to the benefits of all stakeholders. There is also a second development phase planned at Riverstone Mall, comprising 3,000 square meters of automotive-related retail. On completion, the company's total investment into the Mayerton community is expected to be about 600 million rand. Midval is one of the fastest growing municipalities um, in Gauteng. You will see that uh, we are attracting a lot of investment into the municipality. We're trying to develop the R59 corridor heading south as well as north. We're trying to bring businesses into our area because we all know 
when businesses come and invest in your area, it means more jobs for our people, more or much needed jobs for our people within our um, area. That's Krima Media's Real Economy Report. Join us again next week for more news and insights into South Africa's real economy. And don't forget to listen to the audio version of our engineering news daily email newsletter.